What really bugs most gardeners is when aphids and other pests destroy their vegetables or their flowers. Well, we have a brilliant solution for you. All you have to do is let nature do its trick. The Bug Factory is a bug farm. We raise beneficial insects for alternatives to pesticides. There are only three companies in Canada that produce these hard-working buggies, and they sell to farmers all over the world. The main reason that grower, commercial growers use beneficial insects is because pesticides don't work anymore. Um, pests multiply very quickly, and they quickly become resistant to chemical pesticides. These are called spined soldier bugs that eats caterpillars and beetle grubs. When you roast the gardens in Brentwood Bay started growing peppers and cucumbers in their greenhouses five years ago, they were determined to be pesticide and herbicide free. So they called on the bug factory, who are located in Nanus Bay, and they've been using their bugs ever since. We call it IPM, which stands for Integrated Pest Management, and it's a really holistic approach to uh, managing pests in the greenhouse. So it starts with um, excluding pests from coming in and then once and then detecting them as early as you possibly can and then once you detect them coming up with the best way to get rid of them. So in order to get rid of bugs you have to think like a bug and who better to do that than a bug. One of the first researchers in biological control said that when we kill off the natural enemies of a pest we inherit their work and that's very very true that if there's no beneficial bugs around, then the pests explode and then we're just putting out fires and developing new chemicals all the time. This is the larval stage of these special type of ladybugs that eat mealybug. Now if you want to try having these helpful little creatures help control your garden pests, start off with something simple, like a ladybug. Everyone's familiar with ladybugs that eat aphids, and beneficial nematodes, which are used to kill a wide variety of soil pests. Garden stores are now carrying the bug factory products that are designed for the home gardener. And Angie hopes that people take the time to educate themselves on how these products work and how to use them properly. There are lots of little tricks to the trade. Release the ladybugs either first thing in the morning or late um, just at dusk so that they'll settle and start to feed in the morning and start laying their eggs. Um, some people spray them with 7-Up, which might seem cruel, but it sort of sticks their wings together so they can't fly. And then they do um, lick the sugary substance off themselves and use it as a food source. The one-stop shop lawn and garden pest destroyer is the nematodes, which are little worms that are already in your soil working hard. And when you add another five million or so, they get their work done a whole lot faster. This is a really popular product because it kills over 200 species of lawn and garden pests so that if people aren't sure what species they have, they're there's something in there that's, that's going to kill them. And all of these bugs are completely safe. They carry a bacteria that kills insect, specific insect species. So um, they're completely safe for humans, pets, um, the environment. They're naturally occurring in the soil. We're just trying to enhance the numbers at the right time of the year. Eurosa Gardens is proud to use these hardworking critters on their crops and hope more people do the same. The system is applicable to any crop you produce anywhere. Bugs, they really are the best gardeners that you can hire. They love their job, they work hard, but the best part is they do their job so exceptionally well. And look, here's some great evidence, Eurosa peppers. They're perfect. From Brentwood, I'm Karen Algisma, your lifestyle specialist. Mm.